What's up guys, Indian Sensei here, welcome to another episode of Ninja Voltage and we have the update with us, sadly there is no re-kit in this update, we were all hoping for some re-kit but there is not, but we have the TAM tools, TAM kunais with us, no vest but only kunais if you play a TAM mission, so let's go quickly over the updates, they have added some things, so in the shop like fortress metal shop or point shop or all the shops, now you can choose how much am amount you want to purchase I mean you don't need to buy one by one you can just increase the quantity and purchase in at once so this was the much ne needed feature sadly they haven't done it in the enhancement or evolving um, feature only for the shop so yeah also like uh, second one is accept added a feature when accepting rewards from achievements if the amount of item received exceeds the minimum limit you can hold it will send to your present box so what this means is if you have like uh, 9 9 uh, 4 times 9 evolution material and it is maximum and if you achieve uh, if you accept the achievements and it is going to be more than what you have so more, more than a limit so what will happen is that will be transferred to your present box so you can also accept it later so yeah lots of summoning summon banners are now here available also some uh, ninja shinobite sale and with ninja cards and some installation missions and stuff like that also some of the things have been changed also they have fixes the fixed the bug with the naruto uzumaki six path like uh, if i don't know if you guys know that naruto uzumaki when placed in defense was having some difficulty when attacking i mean he used to stop for quite a lot of amount of time which uh, gave the enemy an advantage and they killed him very easily so now i think they have fixed it also they have adjusted the interval of sasuke uchiha's ultimate jutsu penetrate devastation i don't know what this one so yeah also the uh, half time establishment expansion campaign is now permanent i mean it used to take like two three days to expand your base to another level now it is half and it has been going on for the whole anniversary so now they have done it permanently as of now it is permanent for all the base restaurant bank monument shrine factory everything so yeah also if you are still holding the ticket summons from the step up banner you can uh, even now you can summon on these banners and get any ultimate team battle yeah so yes we are getting these kunais so no vest though but we can get all these kunais from the team battle and if you guys don't know what color does what i already made a video on that so go check it out also they have given some instructions but these are not in order so what scarlet is this first one that is lunch citrine kunai means the yellow one which is impact ultramarine kunai is the purple one annihilation amber kunai is the brown one uh, manipulate and evergreen kunai is the green one release so yeah also they have given the limited type achievements which comes with uh, team battle also this new uh, tool horse scroll with empty slot one yeah also they have added this permanent mission learn how to place installations so you can new player especially can check it out how the installation are placed for the maximum benefit also this gives you some shinobites by completing them all so benefit to everyone also this is a ninja tool production mission so this has like six stages or five stages and it gives you lot of uh, ninja tool materials so that you can create some tools from factory uh, also uh, it has some condition i will go into that later now christmas in he hidden leaf village clear the mission and get exclusive ninja tool so they have given us a bad stat card this one i will show you the stats And 
this one is decent kunai with 354 attack and stuff this is nice this all this is also a good tool almost as almost close to the vest this one is not that useful but okay i guess this is the nature resistance all nature resistance by 8% and this one is all nature power up by 7% also you if you complete this mission from stage 2 to 5 you will get these tools uh, i mean average tools not so high especially for new players you can complete the missions and have a chance to get these tools and you can get these multiple times because this is dropped every time you uh, clear the mission so yeah now shinoite sale this one is the old card we used to get this one also this is a new card this one sakura and hinata in christmas dress nice looks nice uh, this is a green card so not that great i would say only hp and defense uh, you can use them use this card on shishui i guess now impact and release summon banner so what for 900 shinobites you will have guaranteed ultimate jutsu of either these three and even this banner of these three so i would say not to waste your shinobites on them also we have one more trap banner sasuke kirin the new kirin and amaterasu of itachi this one is good but not guaranteed actually uh, so yeah i am i always always recommended recommended uh, guaranteed summons not like very less drop rate someone so yeah save your shinobi guys and time slip arc final celebration login bonus so what is this actually in borudu series time travel thing is going on right now if you are watching so this is related to that the artwork looks cool but the card is bad so 70 shinobi as login bonus some ability points some summoning tickets yeah now let's look into the missions quickly and this is the christmas in hidden leaf mission just complete it very basic mission complete it and have a chance to get these tools and uh, limited time so what this have has conditions uh, you can see it is written has conditions so what this says is you have to use like these mentioned characters on the top right for the maximum amount of item drops so this is very very for every mission so first look into that you even don't have to look just when you press next you can see the treasure box on these characters are not on rin so you just have to use someone who has a treasure character treasure box on them so this would be good to go so yeah same for every stage now regular mission uh this is a permanent mission banner so you will get some sheen bites from here so yeah pretty good also guys sadly they have now removed the everyday voltage summon so now it's again reset to five days once in a five day uh, so yeah also the achievements are gone i mean not gone i mean now you will only get five shinobites per day and previously we used to get double benefit in the daily achievement now it's again half so five shinobites and i think very little chakra and reo and one one copy of the green ninjutsu synthesis card also as you can see mini games are no more so sadly they are gone yeah what to do nothing to do here also the shop as i was telling you you can now purchase these stuff multiple times so yeah this is cool but not this doesn't apply for enhancement or evolve so i don't know when bandai will give us the this is much needed here guys so bandai if you are listening give it here in the evolve as well as enhance we are waiting for it so yeah that was pretty much it yeah one more thing guys uh if you don't know already and team battle if you want these kunais then you will get it from guaranteed from fortress 3 instead of zephania montgomery and special fortress we now have fortress 1 fortress 2 and fortress 3 so fortress 3 gives you guaranteed kunai any of these five and fortress 2 has like very little chance like 20 percent chance of getting a kunai otherwise you will get guaranteed of these ninja tool materials and any of these frogs fortress 1 also uh, same so basically fortress 1 is montgomery 
Fortress 2 is Zephaniah and special fortress is now fortress 3 so yeah also guys if your ninja tool inventory is full and if you win a kunai then th that will not be added to your inventory so make sure to have enough space in your ninja tool menu so that you still have a uh, space for the new tools so as you can see i have 82 so i will have to sell something like these these tools useless tools so instead I will make space for the new kunais so yeah make sure to have enough enough space otherwise if you go over the space then your kunai will not be mentioned in your inventory so you can either increase your inventory limit or you can just sell useless sword tools if you get the kunai so yeah so that was it guys hope you guys like the update and I am gonna do one more video and sadly i was busy a lot so i didn't upload it also giveaway is going on you can check out my giveaway video for instruction in if you want to participate also i will uh upload the result video tomorrow i think tomorrow or day after tomorrow so yeah you still have time like one day time uh i think that was pretty much it so hope you guys like the video and see you again next time until then sayonara